This was not supposed to happen. We were not supposed to be here today. This was a mistake. I want Mario to recount the votes. I don't believe it. Me What's too. going on? Me too. He, he needs to. Uh, Come on, Mario. Um, yeah. This isn't supposed to happen. Everyone was shocked. Nobody expected you or Sweet Suspense to go home. Yeah. What the hell is wrong? What's going on? I don't know. That's just the way the cookie crumbles, as they say. You know, everyone's got to go home eventually. Yeah. And I think. But it wasn't your time. I, Do you feel like it was your time? It no, your time. I, I didn't. I wasn't expecting this tonight, honestly. I felt like my performance last night would at least get me through to the next week. Yeah. And, you know, I think that perhaps what the judges said is right, that it was, you know, a matter of people thought that I was safe and they really wanted to save other people that they loved. Yeah. You know, and, and that's just the way this stuff works. Because you put your heart out. I mean, at least you went out on a high note because that performance, I don't know if you watched it back, but you look like, you know, Miss Potter Superwoman. I mean, you were like air blowing, you know, crazy. I mean, it was amazing. So at least you went out on a high note, right? Yeah, absolutely. And I, you know, I feel like I still did my absolute best tonight on my Save Me song, you know, and asking the judges to save me. And I, I did the best that I could. And ultimately, you know, it was a really difficult decision and one of us had to go. So, yeah, I mean, I'm not surprised Kelly obviously saved Kaya because I mean, um, Demi, Demi, because, because yeah. yeah. Kelly, what's wrong with your life? What's going on? You mean Demi? No, because Kelly Wait. didn't Kelly. No, no, no. Kelly, Kelly was on me. your team. Oh, Paulina was the one Paulina. who's on. Yeah. Paulina. Paulina, girl. I mean, just your interviews have done so well. The fans love you. We've had, like, celebrities that follow us, like your photos, like big directors in the Philippines and oh, um, nice. big choreographers and stuff. So, I mean, nobody expected you to go home. Well, thank you. I, I really am very disappointed. I had some very fun stuff planned for next week and the week after, and I'm very disappointed that I don't get to be a part of it. But ultimately, you know, I don't... I don't know that I ever really got my hopes up that I was going to win this whole thing, but I was just very grateful for the opportunity and feel very honored that I made yeah. it this far, you know, to the top 12 is quite, quite an achievement. And well, I'm then, very proud of that. Well, the good thing is the country community protects our own, saves our own, got their back. So what's the next plan? What are we going to do so we make sure that like by this time next year, you're performing here as an artist with your CD? Well, I've got a ton of songs that I've written that I'm ready to put out. And, you know, so next step is we'll see if anybody's interested. There's plenty of of record labels in Nashville you know and I'm just gonna go back home and start pounding the pavement you know I'm not afraid to work hard and to continue on and I've got great material that I'm really proud of because you know something that America doesn't know about me is that I am I'm a songwriter and Absolutely. and I you know I wasn't able to show that on this show but that's something I'm extremely passionate about equally as singing and, um, you know, so I'm just going to continue to do what I love, and that's to make music. Whether it's with a label or without one, I'm, I'm not afraid to yeah. uh, to go and just go keep going after these dreams. What do you want to say to everybody that's kept you around this far? I just want to say thank you because this support has meant everything and just has continued to help me dream bigger and bigger. And, uh, you know, I think for a long time in my life I settled and I was afraid to really reach for what I wanted. And now with this incredible support that I've gotten from you guys, I'm just going to keep on reaching for the stars and hopefully get some music out to you as soon as I possibly can. Lastly, what are you going to do first? Are you going to go on a couch and cry and eat ice cream? Are you going to write a song? Are you going to beat something up? Like, what's the next thing you're going to do to get the vent out? You know what? I am probably going to get drunk. <laughs> Good. Because I'm a country girl who drinks beer. Yes. Um, but I've got a press call tomorrow at 4.45 in the morning, so it's so probably going to be <laughs> tomorrow night. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, no, I'm just going to, I'm excited to go back home. Yeah. I miss my home. I miss Nashville. I miss my boyfriend and my family. Yeah. And, you know, there's a silver lining to everything. And I'm just excited to get started and, and working towards this in full force. Absolutely. All right. This is not the last of Miss Rachel Potter. If you follow her and keep up with her, she will amaze you and do a bunch of big things. And you got to be there along. I do have a record on iTunes, actually. Okay, right buy, now. It. buy it. Buy yeah, it, buy it. I put it out like a year and a half ago, but it's there. It's, it's called Live the Dream. So if you guys want to hear some of the stuff that I have written, you can check that out. All right. And she will be back for the finale. And we love her. Rachel Potter, make sure you buy that album.